Hello, this is Utilitech. Dwight speaking. Hi Dwight, this is Jim from the IT department. We're doing a company-wide password reset, so we need to get everyone's old password in order to reset them. You'll get a password reset notification when you log in tomorrow. Sure thing, Jim. My old password is Bears Beats Battlestar Galactica. That's all lowercase with no spaces. Thanks a bunch, Dwight. We'll get that changed right away. <laughs> Bears. <laughs> Beats. A man tells his password to his company's IT department. Seems harmless enough. They say that a trusting nature is a virtue. But they also say that a sucker is born every minute. We'd all like to think that pale hackers typing away in dank basements pose the greatest threat to our networks. It's an evil we can understand, a threat that feels contained. But we live in a world where evildoers prey on our virtues, turning them against us. Telephone scams like the one you just witnessed, or phishing attacks using email, pervert our willingness to be agreeable and trusting. Malicious elements pretend to be trusted authorities in the hopes that users will willingly hand over precious passwords. And users do. It turns out that we are the greatest threat to our networks. It's just the sort of twist you'd expect in the social engineering zone. No one likes to be cooped up indoors all day, but the unwary may fall victim to the predations of devious tailgaters. These malicious malcontents follow legitimate employees through locked doors, pretending that they belong. To thwart them, make sure no one's following you through a locked door. If someone tries, make them show you some form of ID or even produce a key for the door you're going through. You might feel comfortable leaving your office computer unattended and unlocked. After all, your coworkers are trustworthy, aren't they? However, on gaining access to a secure building, all a tailgater has to do is wait for someone to take a bathroom break to gain complete access to an otherwise impenetrable network. Consider it vital to lock your computer when you walk away from it, even if it's just for a short time. Also, make sure your user account is password protected. If you think that locking your computer is a sure protection against wrongdoers, think again. Why wait for you to get up for a break when it's just as easy to stand behind you and watch over your shoulder? They'll watch you as you type passwords, access secure documents, and communicate with other employees. Always make sure there's not a stranger shoulder surfing behind you. If the prospect of looking over your shoulder all day sounds onerous, invest in a screen filter, which makes it impossible to see what's on your screen unless you're right in front of it. Even the most tightly controlled offices often have an Achilles heel. Dumpster diving. Criminals are a shameless and stinky lot, not at all above digging through trash to find sensitive information. Companies have toppled. Individuals have had identity stolen, all by being careless with their refuse. Make sure to shred any trash that you don't want prying eyes to see. After all, one man's trash is another man's treasure. We often find it comforting to ignore the dangers that surround us on all sides. The world we live in, however, will brook no such fictions. The unaware and the naive become victims of wily, ruthless criminals who forever stalk the social engineering zone.